Hey fam, sorry for the late video, but I'm just realizing because I haven't watched any news today that there is actually a storm that may be headed to Florida. And this is one of the reasons why we need to prepare before things take place. Because as you can see, you have a line full of cars waiting to get fuel. Even the fuel truck is waiting to get in to leave fuel. The Costco nearby sold out of water. People are buying up everything that they can possibly think of to put into their homes in case they lose power, things that are shelf sustainable. So y'all, I pray that this, you know, goes the opposite direction, but if not, I pray that everyone gets through it safely and this should be a lesson to all of us to go out and prepare today, prep today so you are prepared for tomorrow because you don't know when these storms that they say is going to turn out to see actually say, nope, I'm coming in and uh, you're forced to run out and grab whatever you can find. In grabbing those items, make sure you get you a generator, whether it's a solar one or a gas one, preferably both. And also get you some fans, get you as much stuff as you can to help you clean up afterwards in case your home is damaged. Get you some tarps in case you have to cover something. I mean, it's just a sad state of affairs that all of these things are going on at the same time. But you guys, this is life and we'll get through whatever it is. Make sure you have your flashlights, your coolers, get you some ice and put in your deep freezer. That'll help keep your food nice and cold. I mean, it's just, y'all, let's pray over it. Check out these lines at Sam's Club in Fort Myers. People waiting to check out after filling their carts with water and other essentials. A lot of stores are running out of water. Heather, yeah, look at this line right here. Expect lines like this at gas stations all across our area. Even this tanker here behind us, it took about 30 minutes just for them to get to a spot where they can start putting gas back into the station. And then you see things like RVs pulling up at gas stations as well. And then Costco, I just went and checked a second ago. They are now out of water and generators here as everyone is preparing for these storms next week. On this storm, yes. Uh, there's all the potential out there for it to be a disaster, a major one. I got lots of water, bread, peanut butter and jelly, obviously. Lines are getting longer and parking lots packed for grocery and gas. Southwest Floridians are bracing for the next storm surge of shoppers. Put it in the hurricane bin. Canned tuna saves forever. <laughs> oh, I need flashlights, batteries, you know. Oh my God. This thing looks cool. Stores like Sunshine Ace Hardware have batteries, weather radios, and propane tanks for grilling. We're trying to make sure that everyone has everything uh, that they need. Owner Michael Wynn says trucks with more supplies are on the way. Assuming that there is an outage uh, with uh, the cell phone antennas, we do sell weather radios as well as fans and other things to be able to keep yourself cool and connected. Adding it's just as important to think of supplies needed after the storm. So it's always good to be able to have some tarps to be able to put those up immediately after the storm so that you limit the water damage to your home. Making sure that you've got extra gas cans. Remember those lines from Hurricane Irma. But it's the shopper saying don't wait to prepare. You don't want to take a chance. Good luck. <laughs> and though she is laughing about it, it's really not a laughing matter. I don't know why we as people always most of us wait until something is happening to run out. And I can picture that happening if something other than a storm were to take place. Everybody is going to run out at that same time. Oh, I need to fuel up. Oh, I need to get these to put on my shelves just in case. We need to do the just in case before these things happen. Otherwise, what she said is good luck. That's exactly what you will need because you will be lucky to find a generator, lucky to find fuel, lucky to find flashlights and batteries and whatever food you're looking for that you think is going to sustain you through something. You will be lucky to find that. So instead of putting your odds on, well, I'll just get it when, 
Go out today and get it now.